Oh, hey guys, I didn't see you there. Make sure to subscribe and join the family. Well, let's go. Come on. Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I'm going to be doing the finally long-awaited reacting to my subscribers' dolls. I have been putting this off for a while because I just wasn't in the mood to film it, to be completely honest. I do want to film it, I really want to get this video out here, but for some reason, I just have not been feeling it, and here we are. Um, but my next video is gonna be really exciting. It's a bunch of controversial opinions on American Girl. But today I'm really excited about this video because I actually really did wanna make it. It's just, it sounds kind of daunting, like all the things I'll have to do in order to make this work, like inserting all the video footage. So we'll see if all the other videos will kind of cooperate with me and if I'll have the videos in this video or if I'll just kind of be putting in pictures and talking about them. So um, all the people that I look at their dolls, I will link their uh, channels in the description down below or their Instagram or whatever. So we'll see what happens with that but um you know it, it should be interesting we'll see what happens um i think that you know i think everybody has a lot of cute dolls and i'm really excited i very quickly realized that i can't react to every doll that somebody has because it would just take forever so i'm just gonna pick a few from each person and react to those dolls so without further ado let's just get right into it and i hope you guys enjoy this video if you do make sure to like comment and subscribe and of course guys turn on those post notifications so you guys know when i post because it's not really a consistent schedule and as much as i'd love to have a schedule um it's not realistic for me because i feel like if i have one it'll just kind of make me not want to film so you guys and me are going to be better off if i don't have a schedule so just turn your post notifications on so you never miss a video and let's get started okay so first up we have my friend kyla <laughs> I'm pretty sure at this point you guys all know I love Kyla's videos. I love her channel. I talk to her a lot and she's just got a really cool collection. So I'm going to react to her channel. Um, I've seen all of her dolls a million times, but I just figured it'd be kind of fun to react to some of them. So this is her all of my dolls video for summer 2020. Like I said, I'll link all the videos below. She has just like a Hello, cute little intro. Welcome back to the channel. Long awaited and highly, highly Okay, guys, I don't even need to watch this video to like first just say like her entire front row I'm in love with and the second row too. Like those are all the dolls that I'm crazy about. So um, if you guys don't watch her, make sure to go check her out because she's got gorgeous customs. So already on the far right, I can see Yasmin. Yasmin is one of my favorites of hers. I love Yasmin. She was a custom by Sebri Paints and she's gorgeous and she's kind of like a little brat doll, so she's super cute. Um, next to her is Merlot, who is a custom, I wanna say a custom 84, um, and she's gorgeous. And then also I love Sienna, number 83. And then behind them is one of my all-time favorites, um, Angel, because everyone knows I love Angel. She's a custom Joss, and I, yeah. So Kyla, I mean, really, your dolls are just to die for. I mean, but yes, okay. So that is Kyla. I don't wanna go too into it, like I said, but I love all of her customs, and also 83, and she's got some seriously cute historicals, but again, I haven't gotten in anybody else's stuff. Here we go. Okay, so this is AG Star Films Summer Lookbook. I don't know why I picked this one. It was just seemed like it probably would have some of her dolls in it, and, um, I don't know. So we're just going to take a look and see what doll she has. I like the background music. Okay, Grace. Uh, I love, I love, love. Okay, I got to pause it. I absolutely adore Blair's meat outfit. I want it so bad. I don't even really care about Blair that much, but her meat outfit, the little bee thing. Oh my God, I'm in, I'm, I'm in love. I love it. I need it. Um, we'll see what happens, but Grace looks adorable in it. So I, I love Grace. That's so cute. I wish I was that like willing to make stop motions. It's it's exhausting. Ooh, okay, I like that outfit. Um, I can't tell what doll this is. I think, hold on, I need to turn my brightness up. Is that Samantha? I think it's Samantha. I don't know for sure. Um, is that a Pleasant Company, Samantha? I'm, I could be totally wrong, um, but she's really cute. I like her vintage style. Okay, let's see. Yeah, really cute. Just. I mean, okay, wait, Blair in a swimsuit, okay. I love her hair. I mean, she's just the cutest thing. I really do like Blair. I mean, I said that I didn't necessarily need her because I wanted her meat outfit, but I really do like Blair. I want a pale skin doll really bad. I don't have one yet, but ugh, she's really, really cute. Um, uh, yeah, I don't know. I mean, just kudos to you to making these stop motions. Like, I... I've tried and they are exhausting. Like if you guys have not made a stop motion, like just know it's exhausting. Like, so just 
all the props in the world to those people who do it because I, I can't even imagine. Okay, so let's move on to the next collection, which is AG on the Move. I I know she's had some more recent videos where she has other dolls, but I just found the one that was her AG collection. So I know it's gonna be missing a couple, but again, I can't really judge every doll too. So first thing I see is Isabel, really cute. I know a lot of you know I'm not like the hugest fan of Isabel, but for some reason I prefer used Isabels over new ones. She's also got Sage. Like, I mean, I love the girl veers. I think collecting girl veers is just the coolest thing in the world. Okay, let's see what else you got here. Okay, you have a Ruthie. I love Ruthie. I want a Ruthie so bad, but I don't think I'll ever have one. Um, but she's so cute, and you're so lucky, and oh my god, she looks adorable. I'm obsessed. Love it. 100%. Okay, who's next? Kit. I... I have Kit. I love my Kit. I think Kit is super unique. I know a lot of people have her and a lot of people aren't that excited about her, but I think that her hairstyle is just so unique that it's, I mean, she's a doll that you just, you have to have or you have to know someone that has it because she's just, she's iconic. She really is. Okay, let's move on to Summertime AG and I found, she made my tag. If you guys remember when I made a tag, she redid this tag and I, of course, had to pick this one because, you know, it's my tag and I want it. I've seen it already. I'm not gonna lie guys, I've seen it. <laughs> but I figured I'll react to it with, you know, the dolls. So the first doll you see with her here. I love this doll. I don't know which doll this is. I've seen her in a few videos. I think she's 60 something. But I'm obsessed with her and you did such a good job on her onesie. It looks like a Pikachu onesie. I don't know if that was your intention, but like Pikachu from Pokemon, it looks like that in a onesie and I'm impressed because I, guys I've tried sewing recently and it, it doesn't go well for me I'm seriously it's it's just it's a thing and I don't know that it'll be a thing for much longer but if you're wondering yeah I've tried to sew I might get better or I might give it up we don't know yet but I'll keep you guys posted okay keep going on uh, let's get I love her I really do okay so she has a Julie your Julie obviously I have a Julie I know that I say a lot of the time that I don't like Julie that much and it's true I'm not the hugest fan of Julie but I can definitely appreciate Julie I do think that she's really cute with like her whole iconic like collection and her decade and I really do like Julie as a concept and like when I didn't have her I wanted her really bad because I think in pictures and in videos she's so cute and I fell for her when I saw her in Stephen Swoboda Dancer's videos which I know a lot of you guys don't know who she is because you're too young but like back when I started collecting like really hard in 2010 she was a really huge youtuber that I was obsessed with and she's the reason I started my channel um but yeah she had a Julie and I was obsessed with her because she looks so cute on camera it's just in person personally she's not my favorite but I still I I obviously appreciate Julie a lot. Okay, who else? Ooh, do I see Kan? I see Kanani. I, you guys know, I am a huge Kanani fan. I adore Kanani. Kanani is probably like, I don't even know. She's definitely in like my top five dolls for sure. She's at number three right now, but like overall, of any doll that's ever been released, she's so high up there because she's gorgeous. Okay. She actually looks pretty good. Like, you did a really good job. Okay. Ooh, Krissa, Krissa, Krissa. See, Krissa is such an interesting doll to me because I feel like a lot of people don't have her anymore. Um, or they have her, like, you know, only older collectors do because she was released now 11 years ago, which is insane. Um, but I, when I first got Krissa, I was absolutely in love with her. And so it's really cool to see even younger collector, collectors having her because I know for a long time she wasn't I mean I don't know I I don't know where I'm going with that but anyway I love Krissa yeah it does it happens she just said that she's the third person to own her and I can see how that happens how their hair gets kind of crazy because I've had a few dolls where I don't know where they came from or their history or anything but you can assume based on how I got them that they probably had multiple owners and it's hard sometimes with those dolls because you can't always fix them, but you can always appreciate them for what they are. And so you just can't expect to have a doll that's at 100%. Um, but yeah, she looks really good. Okay, so we're going to stop it there because I have a few more people to talk about. And we're already almost at 10 minutes, so 
we're gonna go to obsessed with ag um this video i chose is not like a huge video of like all of her dolls because i did, don't think she has one of those but i i chose the one called opening Lindley because i know she got a new doll and her doll is really cute so i figured i would watch it again i've already seen it like i said guys i watch a lot of your videos i know that i don't talk about it very often i don't talk about like who i'm subscribed to but i really i'm secretly subscribed to a lot of you and i secretly watch a lot of your videos i'm just really bad about like commenting and stuff because i just i don't know i i i can't explain why but you guys will see me every once in a while in the comments and stuff and i you know i'm really bad about actually having having time to watch videos so by the time i actually watch them it's like too late and i feel awkward commenting but anyway okay let's go so she's taking off the hairnet which is my favorite part honestly as you guys know i love her i think is she number i'm not even gonna try to guess what number she is because i know i'm gonna mess it up um i was gonna say 87 but i know that's not right um 67 guys i'm just my mind is not working right now i'm gonna put it right here whatever number she is i'm gonna look it up later because i do like this doll and i do want her Ooh, like yeah, so she's super cute. Okay, moving on. This is a video from Delia Mooney. Um, this is her One Bad Week AGSM. Um, and so I'm going to react to it. The very first thing I see when I click play is Ivy. Um, I love Ivy. I want Ivy, as most of you know. I'm obsessed with her. I don't think I'll ever have her. Ooh, she has Claire, who I think is a Blair... Wait, does it look it, does she have freckles did you add freckles to blair i that's so cute i could be wrong guys i might be going blind anna um ooh, okay she's an isabel i like what you did with her hair i think that's really cute i'm a fan maybe that's what i need to do to my isabel to make me like her more we'll see what happens okay let's see who else we have ava who is a mckenna i'm a huge mckenna fan i love mckenna she's so cute Oh, and you have a mini doll. Okay. And Brooke. Oh, wait. Is Brooke the same doll? I feel like Brooke is the same doll that Summer has that she named Summer. And I love this doll. I'm obsessed with her. Even like, oh, I love her. Um, Which doll is she, guys? If I, I, I need it. I, I really do. Like, I, I need her. Um, I'm just going to put it like that. I love this doll. Okay. All right. So that's her collection i love your collection you've got a really amazing set of dolls and there are a few dolls you have that i don't have that i want really bad so i'm a little jealous okay and finally the last video we are going to take a look at today other than a picture i'll show you at the end is ag ovations ag2 tag um so first and foremost she has kit i love her Okay, first of all, the outfit Kit is wearing, I think it's Blair's garden outfit, the overalls, and I want them. Like, I low-key really want them, so hopefully sometime I'll do that. Um, let's see, who else do you have? What are your dolls name? You have Skylar in front of you, Rihanna. Brianna, or is it Rihanna? I think you said Brianna. I really, that's a number 44, so she's my phoenix. I love her, of course. Ivy. Ivy. Oh, you have Ivy. So many people have Ivy. I want her. I want her so bad. Um... I love her. I love the outfit you have on her. I think that actually is one of Ivy's dresses because it's like the, is it, I don't even, I don't want to go there because I'm not sure, but I, I love her outfit. Josephine. Josephine. Uh, okay. Um, love, I love Josefina. I want her to eventually, I think. I don't really know. I'm not sure how I feel about Josefina, honestly. Like, I think the idea of her is really cool, but I don't know that I'll ever have her, but she's really cute. You also have Mia. I just got Mia. I'm obsessed. Thanks, who is awesome. Okay, um, yeah, the final thing we're going to take a look at is this Instagram picture from Kenzie, um, and she has all of these dolls, and first of all, I, I love, love your Biddy Twins, I, I love Biddy Twins, I don't have any, I probably never will have any because it just doesn't really fit with the vibe of my collection, but I'm obsessed with them, I love seeing other people with their Biddy Twins, because I, I had always wanted one when I was younger, your Biddy Babies are adorable, I love Krissa, Ugh. I, I, I don't know. I love it. It's so cute. I love your bitty babies. I, 
only have one baby baby who I've never shown on camera because I honestly messed her up so bad. But I am impressed by everyone that can keep their bitty babies in gorgeous condition. Your collection's adorable. Okay, guys, those were all of the videos and the Instagram pictures I'll be reacting to today. Um, I may do a part two someday, but honestly, I'm not sure when that would be. Um, my next video, like I said, is controversial opinions for American Girl. Um, I have a couple more videos coming out soon, and I'm hoping you guys will enjoy those. But like I said, make sure to subscribe, um, leave a comment down below, and join the fam if you haven't already. I will see you guys in my next video. Bye, guys!